Hello lovely people and welcome to my channel. Today we are going to use Smithbox to um, update our mod revolution file which is outdated. We can update that one to your latest version of your Elden Ring copy of that one. It doesn't matter you have a seen one or cracked one, okay? It's, it's work on all of them. So let's head to, first we have to download the mod which is outdated so we can download I know the one mod which is outloaded so let's go do it first head to the next dot uh, next mod.com login first and then write down your games um, Elden Ring and enter and then we head to the Elden Ring first in the Elden Ring, in the Elden Ring we have to search the mod the bot name is enemies Drop more runes. This one, this mod is outdated. So today we are going to update this mod and I mean update this mod CSV file and try to create another uh, revolution bin to make um, a modded revolution bin. Okay, so we had to here. There's a different kind of. See, this is about twenty twenty third. So you can download any of them, but I already downloaded this one. The 51 uh, x50 multiplayer so we can go this one I'll do this one okay I'm not going to download this one again just I'm showing you so add to that one um, just extracted whenever after extracting it we had to the folder here we need this regulation pin but when we don't need this regulation we can create another project our to extract the uh, uh, CSV file from this pin. Okay, we'll sorry. Um, export CSV file from this pin. Okay, the first we do this one. So let's head to the Smith box. Just follow my step. Okay, head to this one. Create a new project. Just give it name, runes, or enemies or anything. Now we head to the desktop, the folder which we extracted. Another X50. We have regulation bin here, but it's not showing you because. Um, that file cannot be only CSV file can be shown okay so we can put it here this one save the project directory and executable you know that which one the game one just go inside application executable and create hold on we late it will be uploaded when it's done task completed let's go back head to the parent now if you look here it said out of date and uh, probably you worry about that how to use this mod because it's out of date it's not the latest version of your game because it's for about uh, 2023rd so this is very old mod uh, yet not updated but it's very good mod if you want to extract the file you need to click on the upgrade param first okay you can click here and it will be upgra uh, upgraded by self click here okay now when it's going to upgrade it it will show you only one param do you see that? Nothing. When you see it, <clears throat> you write on modified. Uh, modified. Uh, modified. Okay. Only it's showing this pattern. Okay. It's upgraded, uh, up, updated. The rest of them are out of date. So we don't need them. We need this one for uh, work our, um, you know, a mod, uh, which is only this one. Okay. Just go to the data like we used to before. Quick action, export entire param to the file. And the folder which we have, <clears throat> we will save our CSV file in the folder. Okay. You can also save um, save your file just uh, on the desktop manually, anywhere you want. You can easily find it. Okay. So we can save here in the same folder. Uh, we need to give the um, name first. Okay. <clears throat> Clear count um clear count crack 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 pattern whatever you can give just remember that you need just a first uh, one or two word or first just a first name of the parent which is you can remember to how to import later on <clears throat> so this is our project so we need to create another new project because um we are doing on the we are doing on the fresh um if we had here 
this is a regulation file this is original Eldering copy of the Eldering regulation file so we not to we can create from another one from this one because we don't need to import in any of modded one um, because some of people want to play Eldering kill enemies and get a lot of runes like um, playing like for run for the money so yeah this is the good good one so we can create another folder to create another project so we can just head here just runes write down as runes um, x50 I believe so yeah this folder we will use for a new project so when you can open here you can head to here in the file file new project create new project okay new project give the name x50 or anything save track to which folder we just created in it this one runes x50 save here executable I already told you which one is ex key the main application file of the game of Elden Ring okay just here import raw names if there's any raw names it will be showing the param so hit click create and if you go to param I already write on the modified but there's nothing modified here because we haven't yet we um, imported any CSV file so yeah so what we need need to write down player 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 okay we need this one okay now we don't have value here so we need to add the value so how to import file we need to go to data uh, import CSV file then we have to add to from files then we have to all fields okay all fields now find the folder which we created and import uh, exported the CSV file um this one oh, no, my bad it's not this one okay this one okay yeah this is the CSV file we created see clear count param okay just okay this one only head to this one okay it's already added the uh, values in the new plus games if you here see there's uh, only just value about this one runes multiplayer this is one okay 10x you can also create this one more like 10 to 50 you can also wanna if you want to change this value you can change it just only one for example manually I'm using just CSV file from the same which is give it to me the same um, value of the data okay value of the CSV file you can also change here click here and you can put here 20 if you want to put here 20 you need to because it's your first game so it will be like if I put for them let's, let's head to first listen okay this is called manual manual um, added editor okay manual uh, parameter so we can do later okay so just here here and we just save this file okay save it save all param when you save all param it will create your new regulation bin the folder we created okay here we have new regulation bin now we can open this one on file now this one is original CSV file I mean original regulation pin of this game so we don't uh, because already saved somewhere if you don't save it you need to copy it and save somewhere first this is okay for you because you maybe you need to play later on <clears throat> on the normal mod okay so before we um, had to to add a regulation pin which we created in the game directory it's better we can check it first okay we can check that how much value we get when we kill the enemy okay let's go now we can turn on the game and let's kill enemy and I want to show you in the right down below on the left I mean right corner of the down below you'll see what the value is it how much runes we get to killing one enemy because I'm just playing on the uh, beginner profile so I think it's okay for me now that's my just a level 8 one okay 8 level 8 profile so it doesn't matter for me so get it okay Kill an enemy there's enemy see how much we rain how much we runes get killing it Plus 64, okay? Plus 64. We just got only 64 runes to killing one enemy. Now we head back and let's close the game. Close the game and let's add the regulation bin which we just modded. Okay? Control C and Control V. Just copy paste. That's it. Now let's see how much runes we get. Let's play again. 
Just turn around. So we can do it now. <clears throat> now I'm gonna show you when I kill the enemy. First we can do this one, then we can change the value in our pattern. Um because I'm playing um new game one, like not one, just uh, just a new game. Plus zero, okay? So we still continue because it's the same profile. We are in this Okay, let's head to the enemy first, and let's see how much runes we get to kill them. You see that? 3200, 3200, we get that one. 3200. That means it's working now, okay? It's working, this mod is working. Before it was plus 64, and now it's third, 3,200. Five, one. You see, Don? There's 3,800, okay? Now, this is... That means it's working, okay? Now, let's change it by manually. It's 10, okay? It's 10. Let's change to 20. Let's see how much value we get in the one game plus. So, I want to show you how to change the value. Okay, let's head to against Smith Box and just click this one. If you're uh, if you're playing uh, new glove new game plus uh, zero the first time, and if you're playing new game plus two one, if you have new game plus one profile, you need to go here. If you go to new game plus two, you need to go here. Okay, so I'm here. I'm going to change this one. It's ten, but I will change it. Okay, I can put this value to twenty. Okay. That's it, 20, because only just I want to change this one, okay? This param. And then we can save all params, like we used to. So save all modified param twice. Let's replace again. Um, game folder and runes folder, okay? Let's, let's see how much we get runes. Place. Okay? Now, if we turn on again this game. Let's see how much runes we will get after we changing the the value of that runes multiplayer. Okay, so you can also change as high value you want to. It doesn't matter. So I want to show you. You can get more runes on this profile. But you are playing like a normal one. You can play normal, but you can enjoy to gaining our having more runes after that you kill the enemy each enemy has different um, you know status some is enemies are weak some is strong you kill any strong enemy you will get more runes like bosses they'll give you more than like 100k 200k let's see how much see 6,300 6, this means it's changed before it's 3200 because it was value 10 now I changed 20 that means double now they give me 6000 and 400 so that means it's working you can change any value any high if you want now I kill again see 7600 each time because that that made me a little bit strong so you can play normally normally the game, but you will enjoy to having a lot of runes. You can play normally, like the playing all time, but you will have a, more runes to level up your um, player, and you will be stronger to face the any boss. Okay. So I told you how to export uh, outdated CSV file, and how to import it, and how to change. Um, value using the manual um, param editor manual param you can use this one also put 30 if you put 30 that means three three times more that value you have if you put whatever you want to just put this one ruins multiplayer 
it will give you more you can also change here anywhere you want to okay you don't need any mod if you want to create your just use smithing boss you just change this value in new game any game plus you all have so you will have this one okay so yeah just close it that's it this is our today video and i hope you guys understand and thank you so much for watching